occasionally when using the OLI software, you run into a hard lock error. The example here is a hard lock error 19, which means that you cannot acquire the port. There are a variety of reasons for this, and one of the things the user needs to do when getting such an error message is to copy the information in this dialog box displayed here and send it to OLI. Please remember that there is information stored below the window, and as I scroll down, you get to see more information. All of this information needs to be sent to OLI. But before that happens, the user may want to try to repair the hard lock driver themselves. To do so, simply click this button that says Repair Hard Lock Driver. This will launch a batch utility which will reinstall the hard lock drivers. After you've clicked the button, the program will flash for several seconds and then prompt you to close. If it doesn't close, close the dialog yourself. Occasionally the hard lock repair button doesn't work successfully. There may be a variety of reasons for this. If that case happens, what you need to do is to open up Windows Explorer, as I have here, and then switch to the folder Program Files, Common Files, OLI Systems, Hard Lock. This directory is installed when you install the hard lock drivers with OLI, and we can manually repair the uh, hard lock drivers. To do so, locate the file OLI Hard Lock Repair .bat. If your file extensions are not displayed, you can look over here for the MS-DOS batch file file type. Simply double click the file and you will see a bunch of DOS windows appear and this is the information uh, telling you what's being repaired. Please report back any error messages to OLI during this step. As the uh, repair continues you may notice windows appear down in your taskbar indicating that various drivers have been installed. This is further indication that the hard lock repair is undergoing normal operation. If the repair is successful, the DOS command window will close. Your hard lock drivers have now been properly installed. You may now restart the OLI software. Sometimes through no fault of your own, the system date of your computer will be set back in time. If the date has been turned back more than 24 hours and the hard lock key was attached to your computer, you will invalidate the hardware key. This damages the key permanently and needs to be reset. Okay. The OLI software will not work until the key is reset. To reset the key in the field, you need to click the Reset Hard Lock Key button. A unlock code will be displayed. This code must be sent to OLI either by phone or by email. It is very important that the software remain running during this time. Shutting the software down and restarting it will issue a new unlock code which will require a new reset code by OLI. So please keep the program running while you perform this step. When you've received the restore code from OLI, you need to enter it correctly into the box. To do so, you can just cut and paste from an email or type in correctly the code from OLI. You'll receive a code that's very similar to this. It is usually groups of four digits or characters followed by a final group of two characters. You can press the OK button to restore the hardware key. Okay. You will be instructed to restart the application to see if it works click the OK button to continue.